scarlet blaze. A clash of ambitions. Edelgard succeeds in containing Ayer's insurgency, and while she is concerned by the absence of the nefarious Tallis, she prepares her army for the next step regardless. The time is nigh to crush the kingdom and central church's growing momentum and put an end to the war. But no one knows that fate holds another cruel twist. I've gathered you here in Garrick Mark because the time has come. We are returning to the front. Oh yeah, I've been waiting to hear that forever. Let's go wreck things. For the next phase of our campaign, we'll be working with the Alliance's leader, Claude, to tighten our cordon around the kingdom. Rather than try to advance on the Western Front, we'll join forces with the Alliance and press in from the East. This means we'll be marching northeast from the monastery and infiltrating Galatea. So long as the Alliance does not attempt any underhanded schemes, our victory there is assured. I hope we can finally end it this time. I don't think I can deal with doubling back again. Agreed. This slog has slogged on long enough. Worry not, friends. I'll not be blindsided twice. I promise you that. We won't rest until all of Fodlan is united. We will fight tooth and nail for it, and we'll do so together. We made some headway on the Western Front once the Empire pulled its main force back. What does it matter when their Minister of Military Affairs still holds Aryan Road? Even if we were in a position to keep throwing troops at those walls, we're never going to crack them. But if we keep digging our heels in here, their main force will be on us again in no time. It appears they have already dealt with the insurrection at Fort Mercius. If they don't come at us from the west, they'll soon waltz right in from the east. Might I offer a suggestion, King Dimitri? Of course, Lady Rhea. We should retake Garrick Mark. It is the only way to reverse our current fortunes. If I call upon the Church's faithful, they will come running from every corner of Fodlan to liberate the monastery in the Goddess's name. With Garrick Mark under our control, we will be able to keep the Imperial Army in check. Additionally, it might convince some of the more fickle Alliance Lords to reconsider their loyalties. I mean no disrespect, Lady Rhea, but this proposal hardly seems... There is more. As you know, the Bishop of the Southern Church is currently seated at the Monastery. If we remove him, it reminds the world anew that Archbishop Rhea is the rightful head of the Church of Seros. I believe this will shake some of the more devout Adrestian lords from their Emperor's grip. While their faith may waver now, Adrestia is still the cradle of the Church of Seros. There are yet many pious believers among their nobility. If we can pull them to our side, it may shift the war back in our favor. We should strike while the iron is hot. I will get the word out at once. Hold, Lady Rhea. While I now concede that your plan to retake the Monastery has some merit, I must ask that you alert no one. And why not? I need only say the word, and an army of believers will flock to our cause. Yes, and the moment the enemy spies people flooding in from across Hill and Dale, they'll realize what we're planning and bolster their defenses. You believe their defenses are mightier than the faith of the people? By the goddess. Have our enemies truly become so powerful? In that case, what do you propose? We entrust the eastern lines to houses Karen and Galatea, then ride in mass toward Arian Road. The enemy will think we intend to assail the Silver Maiden, but instead we break east. East? Then we'll be attacking the Monastery through the Valley of Torment. 
I get your thinking now. If we attacked from the west, Aryan Road would be at our backs, and the Empire could box us in. Very well. I have no objections. My church members will assist in guiding your soldiers through ALL. The monastery is holy and precious to us, and by the name of the goddess, I swear, it will be ours again. Good. Then I'll ready the troops. Lady Rhea, Seteth, I place all of our futures in your hands. Brilliant, I have so this is probably a giant waste of what if we tried this? Just leave everything to me, shall we? Looks like something spooked it. What's wrong, little guy? Is someone chasing you? <laughs> Not that you'd be able to tell me anyway. <sighs> Yuritsa? What's wrong? Wait a sec. Why do I feel like this has happened before? There you are. Uh, yeah. What's up? Not you. Her. The creature who raided the pantry. Wait, you mean... the cat? She is swift. This is not the first time she has eluded my grasp. Not the first? Oh, so this is who you were chasing the last time. Yes, she was injured. I tried to tend to her, but she fled. Eventually, another soldier apprehended her. So that's what was going on. It wasn't a person who went missing, it was a cat. Now that I think about it, I don't know if you ever said she was a person. Sorry for jumping to conclusions. The fault is mine as well. My word choice was poor. Honestly, I'm more surprised than anything. Never really saw you as a cat person. I always thought your antisocial tendencies extended to everyone, human and animal. I only loathe people. I had a cat once, back at House Bartels, with my sister. No kidding. So they weren't always scared of you? No. However, the cat vanished after my mother and sister left. Perhaps it was frightened by the sight of me covered in blood. cat expert, but they say animals can sense danger. Maybe it could tell that you'd become a threat somehow. <sighs> eh, cats are fickle. Anyway, what do you plan to do once you've caught this bread bandit? 
take her with me, and make sure she never steals again. What's that supposed to mean? Look, you practically scared the whiskers right off her. I only planned to give her some food. I wonder why she was frightened. Yeah, I think it's gonna be a while till she realizes you just want to help. True enemy. Solid, solid. What have I done to deserve this? Um, I mean, thank you. What a thoughtful gesture. Well, let's eat. Come back whenever you're hungry. Hi there. What do you think?
This isn't a recon mission, then? Not Sure, I'm free. I feel like I can let my guard down here. It's a nice change. Take the shot? Nah. I don't feel like we have to talk. I'm good with silence. <laughs> it's you. More and more people are making names for themselves in this war. And the bigger the name, the more their head is worth. Thanks. I'd like to find a place where I really belong. Here, now, it doesn't feel right. I enjoyed that more than I thought I would. you into shape. I've got the hang of it. Glad I haven't been wasting my time. Training can be the difference between victory and defeat. I 
put this to good use. Time to work you into shape. I never pictured this for myself. Anything that makes me stronger. I work to grow. Training can be the difference between victory and defeat. Try this out. This will help everyone out. I think I've learned something new. I'll surely put this to good use. Time to work you into can't wait to see how you do. <laughs> That's hilarious. Who knew there could be a merc like that? Yeah, he'd say it with a completely straight face, too. I take my pay in apples. This guy would storm onto the battlefield, lugging around a sack full of apples. <laughs> Truly one of the strangest things I've ever seen. I guess you could say he was hungry for battle. <laughs> Wish I could have seen that myself. He was probably the best smelling guy out there. I'll give him that. That reminds me. Remember when you asked about my past? Yeah, sorry if that was out of line. I shouldn't have pried. No, it's okay. Actually, I thought I would tell you if you're still interested. Are you sure? I'm sure. It's not much of a story anyway. Besides, it's already been seven years. I used to belong to an organization that was less a group and more like one giant mercenary state. Not the kind of place you go for building bonds of trust and camaraderie. Still, there was one person there who I thought of as a partner. Mm. As you can probably guess, he was killed. And that was that. Yeah, that's how these stories always end. I know it was a long time ago, but I'm really sorry. But why'd you want to tell me all of a sudden? I thought you hated talking about your past. I felt a little guilty. You shared your story with me earlier, but I didn't tell you mine. At the time, I wasn't about to go telling some stranger all about my past. But now I think you're at least somewhat trustworthy. So I told you. That's all. Seriously? Wow. I'm really happy to hear that. Especially from you. Why? Everyone here adores you. I'm sure you hear stuff like that all the time. All the time? Come on, that's an exaggeration. 
I've always felt that you were a more distinguished mercenary than me. Earning recognition from a merc I respect is a real honor. So if you see me as some sort of senior mercenary, I guess that makes me the mentor in this relationship. Uh, I guess. I see. All this time I've been treating you like an equal, but maybe I should have been taking you under my wing instead. How would you feel if I took you up on that? Seems like fun. Yeah, well, you know what else is fun? Any person I mentor has to pay for drinks. All of them. No way. What kind of deal is that? <laughs> Just a joke. Sorry. <laughs> I have no intention of treating you any different. I should have known. That's why I like you, Shamir. Another rough night, Manuela? You could stand to learn some manners, you know. I had a little too much to drink yesterday, that's all. More importantly, you saw me perform, right? Yeah, I was at the inn. You really do have a beautiful voice. I was impressed. I told you so. But was it just my voice you were impressed with? Well, I mean... When you were singing in front of everyone, you looked stunning. Seriously. Is that how you always are when you perform for the people in town? Oh, please. In their dreams, maybe. Yesterday was a special occasion because you were there. We had a deal, remember? Ah, yes. The hush money. You haven't told anyone, right? About what I said in my sleep and such? Nope, not a peep to anyone. Not even about the dream where you got dumped. Shh! Don't go shouting about it now! You know, I don't think there's anything wrong with you, even when you are hungover. Really? It makes you seem like a laid-back, mature woman. Just another interesting side of you. One day you're a physician saving lives, and the next you're a warrior on the battlefield. I like all your sides. Like, you say? It's more like I can't take my eyes off you. All the more so now, since I've seen you sing and all. You have all these different sides that come together to form a complete person. Maybe that's what draws me in. It's like, which one is the real Manuela? Of course, the real me is the majestic diva shimmering in the spotlight. Ah, <sighs> if only. I'm not that delusional. Those days are long gone. Apparently, I've reached the age where I must take comfort in the glories of yesteryear. Do you really think so? I think you're probably way more attractive now than when you were all famous. <laughs> my word! Is it just me? Or are you trying to sweep me off my feet? Huh? Wait, no, I didn't mean it like that. I just meant that a person's attractiveness gets more, I don't know, refined as they get older. Like a fine wine or something. Now, now, no need to get embarrassed. How about we get together and talk about our future later tonight? Oh, um, I've got some stuff I gotta do tonight. Sorry. Maybe another time. Oh, really? Fine. We'll save it for another day. It'll give us more time to talk, anyway. Just don't blow me off, okay? Or you'll be sorry. <laughs> that was a joke, right? Manuela? Right? Hmm. 
you know. Hmm. My, how troubling. Dear. You know. Sorry for the wait. My hair simply would not behave today. Are you taking me somewhere we can be alone? What a vast landscape. It feels like you and I are the only ones left in the entire world. has at least a little darkness in them. Is there really anyone out there who is truly pure? Oh, right! If I'm going to drink, I want to let my hair down and have fun. But there hasn't been a lot of that lately. It's showtime. My ideal partner. Hmm. Well, someone who would clean my room without complaining, I suppose. <laughs> You're really staring. Mind if I jump to conclusions about what that means? Enjoy having my hair touched, but only when I like the person doing the touching. <laughs> well, this puts a smile on my face. Invite me along anytime you like. I'll be waiting. Thing is, Let's see. 
Nope. My instruction comes at a high price. Don't neglect your daily studies. You don't say. Uh -uh. How dreadful. Need something? Is this it? 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 Is this it?
Is this it? Got a sec. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army.
everything has its use. Do you have a moment? You sure? Well, how'd it go? Any results, a good result. Allow me to assist with any matters regarding the facilities. Let me know if I may be of further service. In short... Hmm... For the future that's yet to come. Another step toward victory. I'm ready anytime.
witness our virtue firsthand. Are you all prepared to meet the enemy? There's never a disadvantage with me around. This will be amazing! Here I go. No mistake, they must learn who they're up against. I will gladly handle this. Orders received. I think this will go well. I'm prepared. Strength in adversity. What do you say? I'm dragging the others down. Let me help you. Time to make a name for ourselves. You'll have to take things from here. It's not over. I'm just glad I could be of service. You like that? No, I'm all right. Really? You've already lost. I will end you. When I face my comrades after this. Here I go. No, I'll provide some protection. I will gladly handle orders received. I think this will. I'm prepared to see this through. So, sure. About Taste time. more bitter than black as coffee. Mission complete. We'll keep this place safe. Let's bring the stronghold down efficiently. So, sure. I'll take your spot. This is defeat. I'm sorry. Like me now. I'm dragging the others down. Yes, that went great.
I think this will go well. I'm prepared to. I have this. I can't hold everyone back over this. This place is ours now. I cannot let go. I will gladly handle this. Orders received. My guard slip. Keep your eyes on me. Perfect execution, wouldn't you say? We're done for. The rest is up to you. I'm just glad I could be of service. will go well. I'm prepared to see... This will go well. I'm prepared to see this through. I'll take over. That wasn't That's terribly fun. difficult. strong and fended off their assault. I must outwit Eve. Well, would another chapter in the
Long story short, the kingdom is preparing to ride west with a huge army. It looks like they're gonna throw everything they've got at Aryan Road. Yes, we have received similar reports. It's a pretty strange thing to do. I don't trust it. Then you believe it to be a feint? Interesting. Well, if true, there are only so many places they could go. They cannot ignore our troops and attempt to take Deirdre. That would be folly. So the only other place I can imagine they would be after is Garrick Mark. That's what I was thinking. So what's our play? We can't risk losing the monastery. We'll have to send more troops to defend it. But at the same time, we can't unclench the fist we are trying to bring down on the kingdom. Our only choice is to mobilize the full resources of our regions. Spoken like a woman with might to spare. I'm afraid we in the Alliance are already at our limits. But hear me out for a second. If the Kingdom really intends to attack Eric Mach, they won't approach from the West. That would put them smack between your forces in Aryan Road and the Monastery. It'd be suicide. That leaves them with only one option. You're saying they'll take the northern approach through Aelau? Yep, the Valley of Torment, which just so happens to be the route we were planning to use ourselves. The Church of Saros will likely mobilize every knight they've got, and that is a very big army. Supposing you are correct, what do you suggest we do in response? Should we change our marching route to avoid clashing with them? Nope. In fact, I vote we do the opposite. The Kingdom will catch on no matter how we try to deploy our troops, so I say let's meet them right there in Aelel. Interesting. But the valley path is treacherous and difficult to navigate, which will blunt the impact of our superior numbers. Why would we play into the enemy's hands like that? Because sometimes trying to claim every advantage can be a double-edged sword. Leveling the playing field can often be the key to bringing an opponent down, especially if you know you can handle it. Besides, what better way to keep casualties to a minimum than by finishing them off in one battle? You know how to convince me. Very well. I can get behind this plan. Hmm. Is there anything you would like to add, Hilda? You appear to be deep in thought. Huh? Who, me? Nah, I'm good. I'm just standing in because Clot asked me to. If it brings the war to an end quicker, I am all for it. I'll show you what a mercenary can do. Follow me, soldiers of the Empire. Understood. Let's earn our keep. We've got an ally to rescue, so stay on your toes. There's never a disadvantage with me around. We need some help, and fast! Here I go. No, they must learn who they're up against. So, what should I be doing again? 
Sure, let's try. Starting the mission. Provide. So, what should I be doing again? I'll back you up. Hang on. Here I go. No mistakes. I'll provide some protection. I'll take this place down before you have time to strap your armor on. I'm not for <laughs> Not a problem. I've got this. This'll be watch this. Their witness. <laughs> We're done Take for. The rest is up to you. Get I'm sorry. We weren't strong enough. Come on, let's go get it. Starting the mission. Is that an order? Not a problem. I've got this. Here I go. No mistakes. They must learn who they're up against. So... What should I be doing again? Sure, let's try another I'll one. Take over. This time, my turn. Right on. Let's carve a swath through the battlefield. I beg of you, help! Allow me to fight alongside you. So, we are backed into a corner. On to the next one. Now, when might I see the real spots blow? Not a problem. Yeah. Not a problem. I've got oh, this will be amazing. It's all my fault. So what should I be doing again? Sure. Watch that this. was easy. Here I go. No mistakes. They must learn. Their witness. How does that please you? Starting the mission. Is that an order? Starting the mission. Is that an order? Here I go. No mistakes. They must learn who they're up against. Take a breather. About time. So, what should I be doing again? Sure, let's try. Uh, Watch this! It's about time! Take a breather! Yeah. It is time. How <laughs> can I face my comrades after this? 
What's next? I'll take this place down before you have time to strap your armor on. Starting the mission. Is that an order? My turn? Here it comes! Out of the way! You're done! No way I'm running from this! What do you think? Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Good to see you. Allow me to assist with any matters regarding the facilities.
Let me know if I may be of further sir. Allow me to assist with any matters regarding the facilities. Let me know if I may be of further service. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. What a lovely breeze. Truly, there is nothing so liberating as the great outdoors. Your Majesty, Hubert is looking for you. My apologies. I didn't realize you were resting. I only stepped out for a bit of fresh air. I'll be ready to return shortly. Oh no! Please don't rush back on my account. I am more than happy to keep Hubert occupied in the meantime. Please, Your Majesty, enjoy yourself. I'll simply tell him I failed to find you. Ah, and are you cold? I can bring you a coat and some hot tea. I, I appreciate the concern, Monica, but I'm quite all right. Uh, but while you're here, there is something I must tell you. Why are you staring at me, Your Majesty? Is there something on my face? I was only going to say how fortunate we are to have you with us. Those who slither in the dark had you in their clutches. In another world, we might have lost you to them forever. Yes, it seemed they were only keeping me alive so they could use me for some kind of dark ritual. And I can only assume that would not have ended with me alive and well. You saved my life. I wish I could express what an honor it was to be personally rescued by the woman I've dedicated my entire life to. That's kind of you to say, but I only did it because I needed the military leverage. That doesn't matter. I'm serious when I say that the day you rescued me was the day I stopped simply idolizing you and decided you were the one for me. The... One for you? Yes! You risked your life to protect a lowly noble like me! You need to understand the situation, Monica. I was fully prepared to sacrifice you if doing so would bring me even one step closer to achieving my goals. I had no intention of rescuing you until right before the opportunity presented itself. Oh, but, um... Why not? I was under the impression that those who slither in the dark needed you quite badly. And as I required their strength to wage my war, I was prepared to look the other way. When we laid out our plans, your death was something we took as a given. All the same, you still chose to save me in the end. I don't care how you got to that decision, only that you did. You could have offered me up as a bargaining chip, but you chose not to. Instead, you closed that door just so I could be standing here today. Monica, I... I only get one life, and I can't tell you how lucky I am to share it with you. It is my destiny to walk beside you, and that makes me happier than you could ever know. Well, thank you. That means a lot. Are you busy? Oh. 
You sure? Hmm. to assist with any matters regarding the facilities. Let me know if I may be of further service. How may I be of service? There's no stopping me. I'll do what I need to.
The fight starts now. I will find a weakness in the enemy. Yeah. Not a problem. I've got this. Begin. The Sky Spirit watches over me. I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about- Prepare to be- Go! We can win this! Leave this to me! I'm swapping in! It's not over! Let's take it for ourselves! I'm dragging the others down. All done. What is the next order? Begin. The Sky Spirit, what? The spotlight is mine. The enemy's stronghold will be ours. I'm dragging the others down. We did it! Huh? One day the Not a problem. I've got this. Prepare to be amazed. Go for Take a breather. My turn. I'm sorry. You weren't strong enough. Of course I succeeded. This stronghold will fall. You have to be strong. Have to keep the momentum going. I have finished with great success. It is certainly worth an attempt. Begin. The Sky Spirit watches over me. Not a problem. I've got... What's next? I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous. Is it my turn? The spotlight is mine! Huh? Hey! Now! Witness our valiant efforts! I'll do my best! I'm a little... Just wait! The enemy's stronghold will be ours! Impressive, aren't I? Is that all we've got? All eyes on me! Not a, a... We did it! You are no match for me. Inspirational as always. One 
One day the war will be over. Our time has finally come. Prepare to be amazed. Go for it. Begin. The Sky Spirit watches over me. Not a problem. I've got this. My turn? Yeah. We're all done. What is the next order? Not a problem. I've got it. Leave this to Retreat. me. What's next? I won't fail. I'll do my best. I'm a little nervous about. I've got you now. I'm swapping in. You shall pay for this. You hear? This stronghold will fall. Looks like that's it for us. I have finished with great success. Begin. The Sky Spirit. We won't lose, no matter what. Every life, equally fragile. Just in case. You're not half bad. We did it! I've got this. Prepare to be amazed. Go for it. Begin. The Sky Spirit watches over me. Begin. The Sky Spirit watch. Enter Manuel. Taste the breeze. more bitter than the gladiator coffee. It is done. Too, if I just stay focused.
What you think? Indeed. If you would. Right. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Hey there. Need something? See you around. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Hey there. Need something? Is this it? Is this it? Is 
is this it? Is this it? See you around. I was thinking, 